Hello everyone, let's start with question number 23. So it says an infinite line charge produces a field of 9 into 10 raised to power 4 Newton over Coulomb at a distance of 2 cm. So here we are given with electric field that is 9 into 10 raised to power 4 Newton over Coulomb at a distance of 2 cm that means R is 2 cm. Now we need to convert cm into meter. So it will be 2 into 10 raised to power minus 2 meter. Now we need to find the linear charge density that is lambda. So in this we know that electric field is given by lambda over 2 pi 2 pi r epsilon naught. Now we need to find lambda from here. So we will be finding the equation in terms of lambda. So lambda equals e dot 2 pi r dot epsilon naught. Now it will be very easy to convert epsilon naught into its own kind like in terms of pi. Why? Because we can cancel out the terms here. So if I write epsilon naught equals 1 over 4 pi k. This is I got it from k that is 1 4 pi epsilon naught. So I will be putting the value of epsilon naught as 1 over 4 pi k. So let's turn this value. So it will be e dot 2 pi r dot 1 over 4 pi k. Now we can cut the value of pi. That's why I have converted epsilon naught in terms of 4 pi k. So lambda we get is 2 r dot e over 4 k. Now we can even reduce 2 and 4 here. So it will be 1 over 2. So lambda equals r, r in this case is 2 into 10 raised to power minus 2, e in this case is 9 into 10 raised to power 4 over 2, then we have k value. So k value is 9 into 10 raised to power 9. So 9 and 9 cancel out, 2 and 2 cancel out. We are left with only 10 raised to power terms. So we get, when we solve this, we get 2 raised to power 2, sorry 10 raised to power 2 at numerator and 10 raised to power 9 at denominator. So 10 raised to power 2 over 10 raised to power 9 can be written as 10 raised to power minus 7. And this will be in coulomb over meter. Now if you want to convert this into micro coulomb, so you can write it as 10 micro coulomb over meter. These are the value for linear charge density in question number 23. Thank you for watching this.